17 minutes till six new this morning. We have a crew in Puerto Rico digging into the effort to get people back in their homes weeks after a 6.4 earthquake rattled the island. ABC Action News reporter Vanessa Ariza has been on the island since Sunday speaking with people to get a feel of the aftermath. Over the past few days, we have traveled across the island of Puerto Rico, speaking with people in each town that we stopped in, trying to get a sense of how they're feeling after these earthquakes. We began in Ponce, where we saw the damage left behind at a cathedral. Mass, we're told, now being held outside in the city square. About 25 miles west in Guanica, a common image where two-story homes are now ground level. It was there where we found close to 100 people living in tents, too afraid to go into their own homes. And in the mountains, in the middle of the island, we traveled with Florida volunteers who were helping inspect homes to determine if it was safe for families to stay inside. A seismologist who we spoke with says these tremors will continue for the next few weeks and maybe even into the months. Because my greatest fear right now is the reaction of people if they, with fear, would mean that they will get hurt by trying to leave a building when they should drop cover and hold on. Throughout all of this, we continue to see volunteers coming to help. We even spoke with a man who came all the way from Massachusetts just to help people here in Puerto Rico. In Puerto Rico, Vanessa Ariza, ABC Action News.